So, <laughs> I just got invited last week to be a part of Celebrate the Web. Um, it's the fifth competition. And basically, teams are put together and they have to shoot a web pilot in seven days. And so this is the week of their shooting. And my friend Marilyn Michaels is producing, directing, and has written one of the pilots. And I got cast last night. <laughs> <laughs> and there she is! Oh my gosh! <laughs> no, I was determined not to have any photos of me today. It's not a photo, it's a video. Yeah. Like I was saying, um, this is The Family Curse. It's written um, by Marilyn Michaels. And Marilyn had a. Who's Marilyn's writing partner in this? It's co written by Marilyn and Leith. Because he only has one name. And he only has one name. What's your name? I'm Andrew. And Andrew um, is operating our boom, our sound today. Thank you, Andrew. Yes, ma'am. This is going to be cool, huh? Mm hmm. We've got uh, snacks going on. What's yeah. your first name again? Sabdia. This is Sabdia. <laughs> what is your official title? I'm Gaffer. Yeah. Sabdia is the Gaffer today for Team 818. We are shooting for Celebrate the Web. They're setting up the next scene, so I'm going to like try to unobtrusively look. Yeah, this is just run through it from the top. Yeah, so just... Allie Smith. Will you turn this off? With I mean, if you want this is Marilyn. Also, actually, be turning it off so you can just go in and go. Okay. And just click it. And don't worry about actually having. We're to rocking it. it. Okay. okay. Make sure you like Team Eight One Eight on Facebook. Can't wait to see the finished product. It's called The Family Curse, and it's part of CelebrateTheWeb.com, the web pilot competition. And um, fingers crossed, we win. So just left the screening of WGA, Rampart, Woody, Woody Harrelson. <laughs> I'm always like forgetting people's names. My buddy Cleve is with me tonight. What's up, guys? It's your first time at the uh, WGA theater. What'd you think? It is, in fact, I liked it a lot. It was a lot of fun. And we actually Tripping. like ran into a bunch of people we knew. Who, who would have thought? Justin was there and his girl. Just a cool, uh, random. And uh, Justin was actually in the movie. You saw that. Justin, the, uh, there's the a transvestite. The he was a right? transvestite. <laughs> but I already knew he did that sometimes. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> he got paid to do it. <laughs> so another SAG Award screening. It's my favorite time of year. And my friend Dorian came with me tonight. Hey, you video <laughs> I am. This is what we saw. Another happy day. If you ever get the chance to work with Sam Levinson, OMG, right? Yeah, it's great. Look at the cast. She was here. And, and the director and Sam was here tonight. It was amazing. It was a very powerful story. Um, mm -hmm. Very dysfunctional, yeah. but very real family. Yeah, I've known, I know people like that. Yes. Not, we're not saying we're dysfunctional, but... <laughs> well, no, no. And um, the panel afterwards, right? I mean, they, they went too quick. They didn't have a lot they, of yeah, time. Yeah, it went very quick. Well, we didn't have a lot of question time, but I think it's because um, both Ellen and Sam did speak a lot, but they both were in tears. They ended up in tears. Yeah, very emotional. At multiple times. And it was just amazing to hear how this first-time writer-director is 23 years old. When he wrote the script. When he wrote the script, got yeah. Ellen how involved. Old is he now? I guess like 25-ish, right? 26 ish. Wow. She said she spent three years with him. Okay. Right? God. So that's pretty awesome. Got Ellen involved just serendipitously because he was and he on a set. He didn't go to high school. He didn't, he didn't go, to go to high school. He didn't go to college. Um, and, um, and then Ellen fell so much in love with it that she decided to come on and produce and got. 31 um, producers. Yeah. So she got Ellen Burstein involved oh, and yeah. Demi Moore involved. And then from there they start raising money and they did the favored nations clause which means all the principal actors she said double scale which means all principal actors worked for probably about 1600 bucks a week something like that and it was a like 23 day shoot 23 day shoot and everybody had to be there for the whole 23 days amazing huh so this is Mary Pickford, because uh, we're at the Pickford Theater, and she was a founding member of the Academy of Motion Pictures and own production company 1915. And Dorian says, I said you would have liked her. <laughs> He's like, can I get a picture with her? Sure. He's like, yeah, Mary Pickford. You would have probably liked So I realized that this is my third Sag Award screening this week, so I might as well keep the trend going, right? Here's my buddy Spike. <laughs> third, third, third. So uh, very excited to be here on the third. But we've been here before. We have been here before. It was a long time ago. 
at a movie theater, far, far... Oh, it was this one, so never mind. I got nothing. We'll check back in after the movie. Right. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot to get Spike on camera um, before I said goodbye to him, but that's okay, because my roommate Amro came to the very same screening. And he brought you George Clooney. Hi, I'm George. Nice to see you. Uh, no. <laughs> what do you think? Um, it was awesome. It was great. It's a really beautiful film. Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's beautifully... Uh, the film uh, was called The uh, Descendants, uh, George Clooney and wonderful cast as you know, Leah. And um, yeah, it was beautifully written and beautifully told, beautifully acted, um, heartwarming, uh, funny, sad, you cry one second and laugh to the next, they, they kind of surprise you with a joke. Yeah, that was definitely um, the balance. We, we were talking about that too and then they talked about it on the panel, but it went from like gut-wrenchingly sad right. to like very kind of sarcastic, dark, Yeah, yeah. teenagers. Great cast. Saying F the world. Yeah, know? and they stuck around, and, and they stuck around, and they had the Q&A, uh, they came in for the Q&A afterwards, and uh, were very honest about about what was happening, and, and uh, they gave good advice, uh, they talked about how they worked on set, which was a big, really wonderful thing, because um, it, it was an audience full of actors, so they really uh, were able to answer questions that we would want to know. Um, on that, so it's good. I enjoy that. I enjoy when they actually are like, uh, you guys are all actors here, right? And so right. then they kind of change the exactly. tone of, yeah, yeah, yeah. of the panel, really, you yeah, know? Absolutely. absolutely. Yeah. yeah. I love this time of year. Free movies. <laughs> Woo! <laughs>